the Northern Ireland Open actually started in 2010 as a PGA Euro Pro Tour event. Um, and it was elevated to a challenge, European Challenge Tour event in 2013. So 2017 we're entering, entering our fifth year and it's continued to grow from strength to strength with um, record crowds growing year on year. In 2015 and 16 we had just under 40,000 through the gates throughout the week of the event. Um, and really a big part of that is because it's, it's a golf tournament for all the family. Um, we have obviously the golf event which brings our core golfing audience but the family event really is, is all about you know, we have a food festival as part of the event, we have a kids fun area, kids activity area. So something for all the family as well as the golf event. As normal 156 players will begin the week on the Thursday and as normal the traditional 36 hole cut will take place on the Friday evening with the top 60 in ties progressing to the weekend. But on the Saturday the, the top 60 in ties will all play again but after 54 holes there will be another cut and that cut will see the top 24 players progress to Sunday. If there's a tie for the 24th place we'll have to have a playoff on Saturday night which should be exciting for the crowds. On the Sunday, the top 24 players will battle it out um, with 28 matches. They're not 18 hole matches, obviously. We're, it's a shortened six hole stroke play match format. Um, so, with 24 players, there'll be 28 matches, one winner at the end of it. I think, thanks to the, the, the global um, television coverage associated with the European Challenge Tour, it, it showcases Northern Ireland as a, a, a golfing destination um, and puts us in the global golf tourism shop window. Um, Northern Ireland golf is booming obviously with, with Rory, Darren and Graham being our major champions with Royal Port Rush hosting the Open in 2019 and with the Irish Open coming up north in 2012-2015 and this year up at Port Stewart. So it helps to, to augment Northern Ireland's reputation as a great golfing destination. And primarily from a parkland perspective there is a lot of growth potential for parkland golf um, from a tourism perspective, um, showcasing one of Northern Ireland's greatest parkland courses um, is, is fantastic for our tourism industry.